Maximilian from the giant world of tiny things and today we are again working in my little macro home studio where I like to stage creative macro photos and I show you how I execute them. Um, as you can see I already got started without you and the way I typically get started is by gathering a bunch of natural ingredients that I can put together in a creative manner and then just create an awesome photo with these ingredients. So usually by half an hour or an hour into the process I've got a final selection of ingredients that I'll be using and in this case it is a milkweed seed sprayed with water, a reflective piece of welding filter glass, um, water droplets sprayed from a syringe because it works better than a mister and a CD to create rainbow flares and highlights. Now I've got this set up on a soldering station and this is a brilliant macro hack for you. A soldering station just is the perfect tool to hold everything together, keeps your hands free. I found this for I think $28 on eBay, it works brilliant and I modified it so it holds a flashlight as a fill light or focusing aid, whatever I need it for, I love this thing. So on the soldering station I put that reflective piece of filter glass, it's got a nice golden hue to it and it brilliantly works as a reflector which means that in this scenario where I'm using it as a stage it fills in light from underneath which is very nice but you can also just use it as a reflector and keep it in your camera bag if you can get your hands on one. They're not very expensive. Um, so on this <laughs> on this glass plate I'm going to place a milkweed seed. Uh, this one has been um, used a little already so after a while they just get soggy and you need a new one. But the good thing is they come in a whole bundle if you pick one of those little seed um, enclosures. So I'm just going to grab a new one that's nice and fluffy and put it right here which isn't as easily done as it is said because they are very sticky but we are almost done here I'm going to spray this with some water as I mentioned the syringe works a lot better than the actual mister it just makes bigger droplets and doesn't get the whole seed soggy so let's see what we can do here looking nice um, I'm actually I'm actually thinking I shouldn't even do anything about it so I'm just gonna fill up the syringe for later and start finding a composition. Nice! That's just what I've been talking about. The composition is fantastic, it's crisp and in focus and the only little issue that we have is a slight underexposure which we'll fix just by adding the CD. It's going to act like a reflector but instead of just plain light it's going to introduce some cool colors and flares and I really love what's going on here. So I keep shooting, I probably go nuts here and I finish this video with a slideshow of shots that I will have taken. So I really hope you enjoyed them. If you enjoyed this video and the creative input, leave me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. It tells me that you want more videos like this to follow. If you have questions or comments, leave me your feedback down below. And then that's it for today. I show you the slideshow right now and see you next time. Cheers.